what is up everyone we are back with some final fantasy 7 ever crisis um didn't get a chance to record this last night my wife was uh working on a project it was kind of loud so i might get a chance to record this but the crisis dungeons the returning crisis dungeon very hard are here the la pena coast and the gracia path um again for those of you who have already completed these in the past you will be unable to do these again uh, i mean well you can do them again you're just not gonna get the rewards so we can see here we got the la pena coast here but uh, I've already received the S plus ranking, so I can't get it again. Same thing with the Gracia path. Uh, don't forget though, that in the exchange, we do have another five star weapon ticket and we have the Buster Sword again. I'm not sure where they're gonna keep getting these or not. We also have the Mythal Ore. Mythal Ore wouldn't be grab bad to grab also. Um, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this. I I've grabbed two, I'm already OB2 or OB10 plus two. I just don't, I don't know if it's worth to keep grabbing those. Um, we'll see. Uh, also, in news, Pumpkin Fest is coming soon. It starts October 2nd, so this will be tomorrow. Um, we'll have the Looney Lantern and Orange Macaroons that can be exchanged for luxurious items at the exchange. And we'll be getting the Tifa exclusive weapon, the Black Cat's Paws. Four star weapon draw tickets and character specific weapon parts and memories. I'm assuming Tifa being one of those since uh, since we're getting her uh, weapon here. Uh, this will be Halloween stuff. So it looks like we're not getting the same ones as last year, which is awesome. I mean, they can recycle a couple, sure. Uh, but I'd like to see some new stuff, especially because it looks like this is just a reskin of last year's event. So, uh, yeah, give us something new. <laughs> Uh, but uh, yeah, that's that's really kind of all the new things. Um, if you didn't check out the roadmap video, go check that out, guys. Um, we had a lot of new things coming uh, here in the near future. Um, I think I said that uh, the chapter or the first soldier chapter probably wouldn't be until November or uh, maybe it's December. I can't remember if I'm trying to look up the. Uh, yeah, December. I, honestly, I think it's going to be the October 9th one. I think we're going to get the first soldier part two, at least uh, chapter one of that then. Then we're going to get uh, the chapter five for Crisis Core in November. And then I'm assuming Final Fantasy seven, just regular proper uh, next or heck, maybe we'll go into a new spinoff, whether we're talking Dirge of Cerberus or we're talking like Advent Children or something like that. I don't know. People, I've seen people say Advent Children, but Dirge of Cerberus, maybe. Uh, something else I neglected about the November special event could be our crossover event. I said it was going to be Thanksgiving, our Thanksgiving event. Um, that could be the next Final Fantasy crossover that was teased in the developer stream. Uh, or the, develop, the note from the developer. Uh, they didn't say which Final Fantasy, they said another Final Fantasy. Uh, what would I like to see? I'd like to see Final Fantasy 1. Sorry about that, I had a knock at the door. Um, so yeah, I would like for it to be Final Fantasy 1. I know there's a lot of speculation about Final Fantasy 10 or Final Fantasy 6. Some people are even saying 9 again. Because uh, there's that supposed, you know, uh, those the the leaks of a supposedly a Final Fantasy 9 remake in the works. Um, I kind of hope it's not Final Fantasy 9 for the third time. Um, I kind of hope it is something new. Even though, you know, yeah, cool, if they, if they were to do a... Uh, it, you know, if we are getting a remake, but uh, I, I'm not saying let's not get a remake, but um, let's not do Final Fantasy 9 again. We've already had it twice. I would like to see Final Fantasy 1, being a huge fan of Final Fantasy 1, going back to where the game started, getting that Warrior of Light outfit for like Cloud or Zack, um, you know, Monk outfit for T. You know, I'm throwing out all these these things and these are characters where they have like a million and a half costumes like the monk costume for tifa the white mage costume for Aerith, even though she already kind of has one with uh uh the was it the garnet outfit you know the black mage for lucia she's already got a black mage outfit from the final fantasy 9 one uh you know the thief we already got technically with tifa but uh with uh or no, it was with Cloud, sorry. Uh, but, you know, it'd be cool to kind of see some of those, uh, you know, make an appearance there. Uh, again, Final Fantasy X is one that's been talked about. Final Fantasy VI. I don't know. What do you guys think for this next Final Fantasy crossover? What do you think it will be or what do you think it should be? 
uh, let me know down in the comments below but yeah that's all we got going right now so tomorrow starts the newest halloween event don't forget as well though that if you are uh doing pulls for the cloud banner uh that ends tomorrow night it ends with the new update uh i'm not probably gonna progress forward into this i've only got one more pull anyways that i can do i think i want to start saving i can use weapon parts to boost um, his weapon. I did not get lucky on these pulls. Um, I was hoping to at least get that thing to OB6 and I got OB2 getting that far, considering everybody else I had OB6 or even OB10 by that point. Um, yeah, I'm only OB2. Uh, I could take it to OB3 right now. I uh, just don't don't really want to. Until I can get that thing easily to OB6, I really don't want to mess with that. So, it, you know, it is what it is. Not going to complain. But we are going to call that here. Guild Battle 3 is drawing to an end tonight as well. So get your, get your battles in, guys. Hopefully things turn out well and your guilds place well. Thanks for watching. Again, if you do like what you see, if you'd like to hit that like, comment, or subscribe. If you're not already, that'd be absolutely amazing. Thank you again for watching. And we'll see you in the next one.